Hi, this is Dave Chenault with Skylight Systems, and in this short video, I'm going to show you how we integrate Outlook and Office into Sidekick 365 XRM. I will show you how we can save emails, files, spreadsheets, PowerPoint directly into opportunities and accounts in Sidekick 365 XRM Pro. In this case, if we'll take a look here at the opportunity 28 for Andal Personnel Services, I'll open that up and what you'll see is there are no documents currently associated with this opportunity. Now let's go on back into Outlook and I'll go into this email from Dan Pfeiffer at the White House and I want to save this email into that opportunity 28, uh, 28 from Andal. So here's how to do it. I uh, open up the email, I click on the button and I look for the Andal and it's it's not easy for me to find it necessarily. I can scroll down, but let's just type in A N D. And when I do that, I can find the Andal Personnel Services, and I see my opportunities listed here on the right. As I switch to different accounts, different opportunities are presented. So I know I want to stick it in Opportunity 28. I'll go ahead and upload that. It takes just a moment. And then what we'll do is we'll go back over into Sidekick. I'm going to refresh this screen we should now see that email saved into the document tab which we do and if I want to open it up I simply click on the documents tab I'll then be shown a list of all documents for that particular opportunity and then I can double ch uh, click on this particular email and what it'll do is it'll launch Outlook and show me that email right in Outlook and I can then forward it I can respond to it, etc. Now what's really important about this is that email now is available to the whole team and it's uh, been saved in context of a particular um, opportunity that we've been tracking right now. Okay, so I can reply, I can forward, etc. Whatever I need to do with it. Now let's take a look here at um, Word. I'm going to go ahead and do the same thing. I had to, just one document here. Let's go into Word now. Now I'll open up an existing document. In this case, let's do a, a Dutch user guide. We do have our application available in many languages, and this is a, the user guide for Dutch. Let's go ahead and stick this into Opportunity 28. Same idea exactly as we had in email. All I have to do is select the Upload button. It'll then activate the dialog screen for me to pick the opportunity or the account that I want to save it into and then I just pick that and it'll save it right up for me. So here we go, I'm going to stick it again into AN and let's look at that. It was Andal Personnel Services Opportunity 28 and let's upload that. I'll give it a name. In this case I'll select it as a manual and I'll say, I'm going to change that so that I can fix the typo in the title and say OK. It takes just a minute now to upload it's a fairly large document, but you can see that it's pretty quick. And let's go back into Sidekick and take a quick look at how it looks in Sidekick. So if I refresh, what I'll see is that I'll have two documents listed now. And I can then select that tab once again to see the documents associated with this particular opportunity. And if I just double click on it, first of all, notice that the typo was fixed now. So the Dutch user in lowercase, it's named properly. And now I'm going to double click to open it up. Now what's really great is that this document opens up right in the Word web app. And I'm able then to come in and take a look at the document as well. There are a lot of capabilities built into the Word web app. And so you can do things like find, add comments, etc. You can also edit right in the browser. Okay, let's take a look now at Excel to see how that works. So if I go to Excel 2013, I'll do the same thing where I upload an Excel file right into it. It'll take a minute to launch my Excel file. And here it comes. So Excel will load here in a minute. You can tell I've got a lot of activities running on my laptop. Uh, with this recording going and it's still very quick for my saves so um, even with all the activity on my CPU I'm still able to um, work very well so let's take a look here 
Let's try Excel again and see what the problem is. There we go. It was just my fat fingers. Okay, let's go ahead and just put in something real quick. Red, uh, blue, and green. And now uh, I'll put in yellow here as well. It doesn't really matter. Okay, now I want to save this. So if I go to Upload, what you'll see again is that same dialog will come up. A-N, I can't remember that name. There it is, Andow Personnel. That's all I can, I can type in a couple letters. It finds it. I'll put in Opportunity 28. Now in this case, it hasn't saved yet, but I don't have to. I can just go ahead and give it a name. I'll say Colors. And I'll call this one a um, manual again, doesn't matter. I could make a new spreadsheet, etc. Actually, let's do that. Let's call it spreadsheet. So I can give it a new category. And I'll pick spreadsheet now and say OK. And it'll take my spreadsheet and load it right into Sidekick. Same thing happens with PowerPoint as well. So let's um, take a look here. We'll refresh the screen. We should see three documents now. There it is. If I go to Colors, and there comes my Excel web app. There they are. I can edit, etc. And again, the great thing is that I'm able now to save this information right into the opportunity or the account, and I can then share it with my team. Now, the last thing I want to do is I've shown this in another video, but I'm going to go ahead and, and try and do a scan. And what I'll try and do now is scan a document into this Opportunity 28, just to show you the full breadth. This is an additional add-in we have, uh, but I'm going to go ahead and scan the document. Take a little risk here. It'll take a moment for my scanner to warm up. And what we ought to do is here in the background, the scanning start, and I'll put that scan document right into the Opportunity record. So it'll come up here now for me. And you can see the scan is now processing the file. This is a Kodak scanner I'm working with. It's preparing it. It didn't find any blank sheets, just one file this time. And now I want to save that scan, just like I did with the documents and the emails. I can now take all the paper that's running around my desk and store this in the opportunity of the account. And I hope you're seeing how useful this all is. So it takes just a moment to launch the viewer. We'll have that document come up. And I want to put this in the AN Andal Personnel Services again. My opportunity will be 28, so sort of similar. I'll call this one a manual. And I'm going to make this a manual. So you'll see how they're sort of related. But in this case, we have a scanned file versus working within Office sort of a similar thing going on. I think it's important to show you how all this uh, blends together to give you some control over all the documents, emails, paper that's swirling uh, around your opportunities as a business. So again, there's our manual. If I just double click on it, I'll launch my PDF file and you'll see the scanned document now is available for my team. Within a few minutes, it will be searchable, and I will be able to find any word in the document. So again, I hope this uh, gave you a good overview of how our add-ins really make Sidekick 365 a much better application. Um, it lets you really get a hold of all of the information coming in um, at you in one place. Final thing I want to show you, and this is very interesting, is that we have... Um, the capability now if you integrate in uh, different channels of information. So in this case, let's say that we have integrated voice into our system like I do. I have phone calls coming in all the time. So now if I look, I can see I have outgoing calls, ingoing calls. Just like I did with an email, I can take a call and I can take a record of that call, who did I call, when did I call, and even the messages that are left, etc. And I can load those right into Sidekick. Same idea as an email message, but in this case, it's a voice message. So again, I'll do my favorite AN to find that particular one. 
and I think it's called Andow. We'll go to Opportunity 28, and I'll upload this as well. So now I'm going ahead and uploading it. I've uploaded the document, and I'll do my final look at what I'm doing here. So by going in and refreshing my page, I can see that I've got now this outgoing call record right here in my account. And if I open it up, I can see that I have a record of that call that I can share with my whole team. And if it's a voice message, I can also save it. So very powerful. And I hope that this all uh, ties together to show you all the capabilities of really getting organized in your sales and all of your marketing activities. Again, this is Dave Chenault with Skylight Systems. If you have any questions at all, feel free to email me at info at skylightsystems.com. And that's S-K-Y-L-I-T-E-S-Y-S-T-E-M-S.com.